Good luck in this graded comic book box break where everybody gets a sticker spot. We'll be opening up the stickers, uh, open up the box, looking for a matching sticker spot owner. But the first thing we're going to do is run the filler, and you can get into this for a fraction of the price. Here we go, seven times through. We're looking for the top four names after seven. Somebody's going to win some spots for dirt cheap. Lucky number seven. Wow, David D. Congratulations, man. David D. and Troy C. Certainly did really well. Thanks for getting into the filler with us. If you, even if you didn't make it, I would just want to say thanks for getting in there and giving it a shot. That is a filler part of our box break. Now let's start off the big random to see who gets the which sticker spots. Here we go, seven times through. Lucky number seven of the first random is finished. So if your sticker spot matches what's inside this box you're going to hit, let's start with the big random and see about the sticker spot right here. Seven times. Good luck, everybody, in the box break. Lucky number seven. All right, there's a sticker right inside this thing. That's going to determine the winner 
Good luck, everybody, in the graded marvels. Ho! Boom. Let's see what happens. What do we got here? Coming out of the rip. It is the color purple. Purple is going to hit, and that is Scott L. Congratulations, Scott. This is your hit in the break. Oh, my. What's it going to be? It's an amazing Spider-Man. It looks very old, too. It's Kingpin. Oh, my. This is a special Spider-Man edition. This is big money right here. Number 69 from 1969. Kingpin appearance. 9.0. I was thinking it might be the first Kingpin appearance. That's the really big money one. But 69 ought to command some good value. That's from way back in 1969. What a hit. 12 cents is what this cost back in the day. Crush the kingpin. Oh, nasty hit right there. That is just terrific. Ho! Oh. Ho! Oh. Big Hit Boulevard, man. That's so awesome. Such a fan of these vintage ones. These older ones. So nice. The newer ones are great, too. With the variant covers and all, but nothing like a classic Spider-Man, eh? <clears throat> Scott L. came away with a great one there. Purple hit in the break. It was purple that did it. You'll be, you'll like those, man. I mean, you can't really flip through them or anything. They're great, but it's like a time capsule. And it's, it's basically just saved for, for all time's sake. 